Welcome back all you kings, queens, and in-betweens to the channel. We have not done a taste test video in a very long time, but as you can see, what we have on the table here, we have a lot planned and in store for you. If you haven't seen any of our other taste test videos, please check it out on Kings Entertainment Reviews, our sister channel. This is Kings Entertainment Live. This is going to be the new home for all of this live action content that is not gaming related. Yes. Or maybe stuff will be gaming related, but not board game related. Mayhaps. Mayhaps. And we are going to be starting off with a taste test that we've been waiting to do ever since we went to Disney. And that is the Walt Disney World 50th anniversary set of chocolate anniversary edition it was like february was it <laughs> yes we have been holding on to they are still good though they are still good until two months from now so they're still in their best buy date range <laughs> and we are going to be back in a moment with these and we are back from out of space as you can see we can also see why wouldn't we be able to i can only see a little bit my glasses aren't on and uh, we're going to start off our Disney chocolate anniversary edition. That would actually be birthday, but I guess it works. Uh, with the milk chocolate with peanut butter flavored chips. Oh, it's peanut butter. Ooh. Peanut butter. The butter of peanuts. Mm. That's exactly what I would imagine. Chocolate that's been sitting in the fridge for. It tastes six fine. What are you talking about? It has that off like. No, it doesn't. It tastes fine. It has that like I left this chocolate bar in the car for too long kind of taste. But yeah, it was know. refrigerated the entire time. It was in better storage than it uh, is. It was, where be, it's it was under that TV for at least a month. <laughs> <laughs> I think it tastes fine. Yeah, it's um, fine. It's not good. I don't think the peanut butter is a very good quality. Yeah, I don't like the peanut butter. The um the chocolate's okay, but not amazing. So, I don't know. What are you rating this? Are you rating this on a scale of 1 to 10, you think? Um, we should have made a Disney scale. I could do characters. <laughs> so, this is a Pete. That's a Pete? Yeah, that's like a 3. Um, I think it's going to be more like a, um, um, what's it? A Jezebel cow. What's that one? That that cow character. I'll throw a picture up on the screen if I remember to do it during editing. <laughs> uh, but what was that on the it's screen? It's like a, like a three and a half. Three and a half. <laughs> she's that insignificant to you that she's a half point. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And mo most of it just because the peanut butter is bad. Yeah, it's mostly because of the peanut butter. It detracts from the chocolate. And now for your tasting and viewing pleasure... We have milk chocolate with rice crisps. Rice crispies. I'll be honest, I don't see any rice crisps. I don't crisps. see any rice crisps either. Do you taste any rice crisps? Like vaguely, maybe? Like very, very minute if I do. Um it tastes pretty good though. Yeah. This one's definitely better. This one is like a um, like a Huey, Dewey, and Louie. Did the rice just like dissolve in the chocolate? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I can definitely taste a little bit of a, like a crunch in there. Yeah, I'm getting granules. I'm not getting like actual like what you'd expect like from a crunch bar or something kind of thing. Mm -hmm. I'm getting like when you season your mocajete, mm -hmm. you grind, you grind, you grade the the rice in it. Mm -hmm. Not great, but grind it up. I'm getting those little, like, rice particulars. Yeah. Huey, Dewey, and Louie. This is, like, a 6.5. No, 7. I'll go to 7. Yeah, I'll go with that, yeah. Okay. And now for your classic, milk chocolate. So repeating the last round. <laughs> <laughs> milk chocolate without rice particulates. Mmm. That's milk chocolate. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, it's pretty basic milk chocolate. I actually like that less than the rice one. It's pretty. It is one of the chocolates in existence. Uh-huh. <laughs> 
So. I don't know. I don't, there's nothing really remarkable about that. I don't even think it's towards the higher end of regular, like, good milk chocolate. It doesn't reach Hershey's. You just say you like Hershey's? Hershey's milk chocolate is, is fine. It's good commercial milk chocolate. Do you not think Hershey's milk chocolate tastes good? I hate Hershey's. Oh, well, I mean, then you're weird. Lakota is telling you to get out of this house, you heathen. I mean, there's better ones. Lint and um, Godiva and Ghirardelli and all those. Those are better, but you're also spending a lot more money with those. Though these were not cheap. So these were like $5 a bar, something like that. Yeah. So definitely not worth $5. That's the Disney tax. Yes. I'm still, you know, you have, you have other options. Yeah, I do. That aren't like wildly expensive, but like are better and don't taste like. Hershey's is not bad. The butthole of a chocolate factory. Hershey's is not bad Her- chocolate. Hershey's is the runoff that comes out of the Cadbury factory. <laughs> oh, Cadbury. Those are the ones I really I like. That. <laughs> I really like Cadbury. Cadbury. Cadbury cream eggs are amazing. Speaking of things that are not Cadbury cream eggs, let's move on to the next flavor. That's yeah. not as good. Get out, you even. But do you not like Cadbury? And now, for the classic of the spicy and sophisticated, dark chocolate. Dark chocolate. Wow, you did bad at Yeah, they, they kind of split. But... Chocolate. I'm definitely more of a dark chocolate man than... Uh, that a milk chocolate man. But you're white. I like white chocolate better than dark chocolate. White chocolate isn't real chocolate. I don't care. It's called, it's called white chocolate and it tastes better. Yeah, because it's <laughs> 80% sugar. Yeah. Newsflash, sugar makes things taste good. It shouldn't taste like anything. So what I'm hearing, Jeremy, is you're a sugar daddy. I'm a sugar daddy, a sugar man. That didn't taste like anything. I didn't get a flavor until the end, like right at the end, and then after. I don't think we ranked we ranked the milk chocolate. What did you rank the milk chocolate? Uh, five for basic. What what Disney character is that? Um, is there an accountant Disney character? <laughs> an accountant. <laughs> <laughs> Prince Charming, all of them. Um, that was the. That was the Snow White of chocolates, where just basic, <laughs> basic, and you want yeah, there's no piece. Uh, I'm good. That didn't taste like anything. All right, I'm giving this a six. It tasted like the Void. Um, two. <laughs> okay. The Void doesn't taste particularly good. I'm giving this a uh, a Minnie Mouse at six. Chocolate sadness. <laughs> It, it's 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 emptiness. It's it's apathy. This is apathetic chocolate. <laughs> I, in fact, I am apathetic to it. I don't. I I I have no feelings about it. <laughs> I don't even dislike it enough to hate it. That's why it gets a two. Yeah. Last but not least on our docket is the dark chocolate sea salt flavor. I do like sweet and salty. Oh, I was disappointed because I heard orange. I was like, oh, orange chocolate, and then it's not. That's like my favorite. I like orange chocolate. You know, it's like those British ones, which it's in the shape of an orange, and you mm-hmm. hit it with those your Those are really good. I've never had one. Never had one? No. They're really good. Never got one. You should get me one. I'll get <laughs> you a chocolate onion. Honion. Well, apparently the, the GMM now is good. Really? This is bad. Why? This is pretty good. I'll finish that later. You didn't even finish the piece you started. Like it's bad. I don't like it. That that's the, that doesn't even deserve apathy at this point. What's it got? A point two seven five. <laughs> point two seven five. What Disney character is that? That's like one of those creepy pasta. Um, <laughs> it get it, it gets. One point two seven five 
creepy knockoff Disney costumes. <laughs> yeah. It gets, like, it gets that, it, you know, that, that photo of like the old Disney mascot things. It's the w- really wide eyed Mickey. <laughs> That's what that is. Or one of those budget mini costumes that people wear in Times Square to get pictures. Yeah. It's like, I like this. I don't think it, I don't think it warrants that. I think this is about as good as the Rice Krispie one, which is what we ranked a seven. I'm giving this a goofy, which is a 7.1. It's bad. <laughs> you should feel bad. Well, you something I bad. don't feel bad about is this. Taste test content here on the channel. If you do like hearing me do outros with food in my mouth, then like the video and leave a comment down below. What is your Disney scale? What would you rank the different characters out of ten? Ten isn't even Mickey. It's it's um it's um Wally. The, the, no, the purple dragon. Purple figment. Dragon. Figment. Figment. Oh, I like Figment. Ten is Figment. It's not even Mickey. Mickey's not on the list. No, Mickey doesn't get to be on the list. Yeah, Mickey. You don't talk about him anymore. Take your promise rings and go home. <laughs> Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of this content going forward, and ring this bell so you know what's up. And we'll catch you in the next one.